everyone, Beth Stein with the Beth and CJ Stein team of Keller Williams. I'm here today at Anselma Mill in the heart of Chester Springs in Chester County. The mill is rich in history with its origins of 1747. It was the first working mill in West Pikeland. Would you believe the miller of 16 years is still grinding the wheat into flour today? I'm excited to take you along today and introduce you to some of the folks at the mill and they're gonna take us through and give us a short demonstration. Come along today for a little tour. We are standing on one of the classic examples of the preservation of American history. The mill itself was certified as a National Historic Landmark in 2006. The property itself, as you will be able to see, uh, consists of structures, woodlands, streams, walking trails, and so forth. We are sticklers for accuracy here, so much so that when the mill at Mount Vernon, George Washington's home, was being reconstructed, the engineers on that project came here to Anselma to make sure they were getting all the details correct. And so you can see it exactly as they did. Hello, my name is Dave Roland Hagen. I am the miller here at the, at the mill in Anselma. You are now in the first floor of the mill this mill was built as a custom mill, meaning the local farmers would bring their wheat in here to have it ground and then take the flour home. And they would bring it right in here to the first floor. What you see ahead of you is the machinery that runs the stones that do the grinding. What you see is what it looked like in 1747. It still operates the same way. We still operated it as it did in the colonial period. The mill is operated over in that corner, you can see the chute going down into the galvanized steel can. So I pick the stone I'm going to use, set the flow rate, the grain flow, set the spacing, and then adjust the water quantity. This is the water wheel. It's steel, as you will notice, not wood. It was changed out in 1906, and frankly, we're very glad they did because this lasts a lot longer. The water comes in over the top and fills these buckets and it's the weight of the water that makes the wheel turn. And this shaft goes into the mill first floor where we just were and drives the machinery there. Hello, I am Pat. I am an intern at the mill in Selma and I am here to show you the Miller's House. The Miller's House has been around since 1873 and is right now used as a museum and office. But before, this is where the Miller would stay. Here we have the kitchen. As you can see, we got these unbelievable griddles and pots and pans right here along with Maxwell House coffee. Um, we also have checkers over here. Kate Smith, the famous singer, her recipes. As you know, they didn't have electricity, so this is the hand grinder they had to use for their coffee. The Mill at Anselma is centrally located in Chester County, and we welcome visitors to come and see demonstrations, to walk our trails, to enjoy nature in a really beautiful setting, and to pick up a little bit of history, whether you intend to or not. So please come out and see us at your convenience. Thank you for joining us today at Anselma Mill. I hope you've enjoyed the tour. Please come out as soon as possible in this beautiful weather and enjoy a hike. Take a peek at the outbuildings. Make sure that you take a visit by the working wheel and uh, just enjoy all things community and Chester County. Thanks so much.